To a developing story now in Old Saybrook and the search for a missing fisherman. He went into the water last night, right where the Connecticut River meets the Long Island Sound. This morning, News 8's Aaron Cox is along the river. And Aaron, what can you tell us about when they're going to resume this search? Well, and we're not exactly sure when they're going to resume the search. And Gil was just talking about it in the weather. You can see behind me, it's certainly foggy and working here and they're hoping that won't hamper when they do get started again. The word of a missing man came in about eight o'clock on Sunday night. The new London Day describes him as a 58 year old man. Basically two adult males were on a boat with two children right at the mouth of the Connecticut River when one of the adult man males went into the water. His friend jumped in but tried unsuccessfully to rescue him. That sparked the major search. You had fire and police boats from not only Old Saybrook and Old Lyme departments, but from others along the shoreline. Also, the Coast Guard involved. They brought in crews from New London down to this area of the Connecticut River. Also, the Coast Guard helicopter came from Cape Cod to search above the area in the overnight hours. We're told they're expected to resume the search at some time this morning. Now, coming up in the next half hour, if you're a local boater, we'll give you some clues on how you might be able to help out. We're live this morning in Old Saybrook. I'm Erin Cox, News 8.